now basically we have uh, done with the chapter this is the summary like basically they ask you what is the difference between homopolymer and copolymer I listed out few for you all so it's easy for you to remember it's combination of all the topics together so as we know homo means similar we've already done many examples for homo just like your pvc we did polyethene we did polystyrene we did so uh, if i have to write the differences so as the name suggests it is formed by addition of compounds one of the other adds here they are going to form by condensation of compounds to condensation where you are removing water molecule alcohol ammonia hcl like that so here as the name suggests again it has only single entity single monomer as homo means single co means two there are two or more repetitive units and again when i have to compare it's a single unit so it is it has a simple structure this has a complex structure i've been discussing the same earlier also so you have examples of pvc polythene polystyrene here i've shown you the example of buna n buna s and dacron also so i've combined together in the form of a tableau column please study this and go so with this the chapter is complete everything is done in the chapter uh, abnormal molecule masses i think we have done in colligative properties also the same topic so let us come back and start with your board papers